Is your shower cycle kind of on and off like this? I'm gonna try to figure out how to fix this problem today. Hopefully, hopefully I'll be able to get this camera in here. So you can kind of see what I'm doing. As it stands, it's kind of a mess. So we'll do our best. Okay, so there are two screws that allow for adjustment. I've got this 564 Allen key in the first one. That's the pressure adjustment, and so we need to get that thing set right. The recommendation, which we'll show on the screen uh, right now, the recommendation is to remove that screw completely and then put it back in nine to nine and a half turns, I think it said. So we're gonna shoot for that. Now I have turned the water pump off so that when I start messing with these screws, nothing bad happens. There is the screw. Now, gonna, they say to mark it, but I don't know how the heck you're gonna mark it. I'm just gonna use the tip of the um, Allen key as my indicator of how many turns I've gone. So we'll start there. Half. Ah! I'm gonna start over. Okay. So. Half a half. One. One and a half. Two. Two and a half. Three. Three and a half. Four. Four and a half. Five. Five and a half. Six. And a half, seven, seven and a half, eight, eight and a half, nine, and nine and a half. That's nine and a half turns. Okay, so now I've moved the Allen key into the other Allen screw, and this one is the by pre bypass pressure shutoff. So this one says to um, remove it completely and push it back in 10 and a half to 11 turns. So I'm gonna go ahead and loosen this one, take it out and then we'll put it back in. Okay, so we're out and we'll try to reach that 10 and a half to 11. So half, There we go. Those are adjusted per the instructions. Now let's go see if that has helped at all or whether we still need to do some adjustment.
Okay, I wanted to do a quick comparison of what the flow was like before versus what it's like now that we have made the adjustments. So same deal. And it seems to be running smooth. I think maybe we just had to get some of the water out of the lines or the air out of the lines. But this is the kicker. When we put this on the power flow setting, it actually seems like it's powerful. So I think I could take a shower like this. All the settings are spraying pretty good. So I like it. Last test I wanted to do here was a pressure test, which I'm set to about 58 PSI, which I'm okay with. So it's all good. All good. Awesome. That's a good deal. I need to go kind of release the pressure from the system now so I can get this off cleanly and we are good to go.